One of Golfing World's resident coaches, Mitchell Spearman, is constantly examining the swings of the world's top golfers. He has picked out some of his favourites and now explains his choices. Hi, I'm Mitchell Spearman. Here's my top 10 list of the best swings in the game of golf today. They might not be what you would think I would choose, but I choose them because they're not only great swings, they're great players, and they all have something a little different about what makes them so special. I hope you enjoy my list. Number 10, Jordan Spieth. Jordan had a breakout year last year. What I like about his swing is two things. One, it's the gravity that he uses to get the club down to the ball. And two, what I like about Jordan is just his confidence. He plays with confidence, he's relaxed. Yes, technically you could pull it apart a little bit, but I love the way he gets the club down onto the ball. Number nine, Lexi Thompson. Lexi's an exciting young player who's now won twice on the LPGA. I love her power and I love the way she really holds it through the ball. Great iron player, really strong with her arms through impact and doesn't let that club face shut down at any point in her through swing. Number eight, I'm going out on a limb here. I like Yanni Seng swing. She's won all those tournaments, she's a great player, she's not playing her best right now, but I still think the swing is as good as it's ever been. It's long, it's flowing, and I absolutely love that follow through. It looks so good, I don't think it will be long before she's in the winning circle again. Next up, Charles Howell III. I've known Charles personally for many years, and I watched him hit a lot of balls on the range at Isleworth. He's a great striker of the ball, and what he does so well is he gets into impact in such a strong position every time. His hands are forward, his hips are open, and he's really tight and balanced throughout his swing. I think he's going to be working himself up the world rankings this coming season. Jason Day, the Australian guy with a great, powerful swing. He had a chance to win the Masters earlier this year. I think he's going to get it done. I like his power. I like the way he hits it full and hard. Maybe just needs to scale back a little bit coming down the stretch. Henrik Stenson, 2013 FedEx Cup champion. Gotta love his swing, it's powerful. What I like about his move is his slightly unorthodox pre-shot move. The way he lifts the club up above the ball before he starts, it looks like he could be a slicer. And then when he swings, he looks like he's one of the best players in the world. Gotta love it, love that follow through too. Lydia Ko, my favorite female golf swing, and she's still only a teenager. Love the way she moves through the ball, really strong core, very stable, really good width to the swing. Love the way her head stays down and back through the ball. She's already winning big events and she's only gonna get better and better. Top three, Hunter Mayhan. You gotta love Hunter's golf swing. It's balanced, it's poised, he's got great flexibility in his upper body. The club swings out and around on a really nice arc. There's no up and down as he really stays down through the shot. Really, really fine ball striker, great golf swing. Probably need to improve his short game if he's gonna contend in the majors. Steve Stricker, without doubt the simplest swing in golf. He played less tournaments in 2013 and yet he didn't miss a beat. His wrists are firm, his arc is wide. Whether he's hitting a driver or a wedge, he's got complete control over the golf ball. Simple move, love to watch it, very repetitive. And my favorite swing is Adam Scott. I love the way he's really improved his game. He hits the ball higher now than he used to. He's got a beautiful arc and width to his swing. He's got the balance, he's got the pose, and he's got the confidence in his game. So when you look at that, it's the classic textbook golf swing. He's got a good grip, good stance, good posture, good radius to his swing, good sequence. All the things you want to look at in a textbook, you're going to find it in Adam's swing. I think he's going to continue to be one of the dominant players in the game today.